Hi there Aquarius, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl and we're looking at July 25 through July 31st. So we're pushing forward into August. Now the most exciting thing that's happening this week has a lot to do with you. It's your ruling planet Uranus, the planet of the unexpected and unusual occurrences, which is taking its one last victory lap with a trine to Mercury, the communicator, on Wednesday, July 27, before turning retrograde on Friday, July 29. A complementary Mercury-Uranus trine like this brings a short-lived whiff of genius to the scientific type of mind, as well as to anyone else who's interested in thinking outside the box. But the Uranus retrograde period that begins on Friday is a different kind of opportunity because this retrograde cycle will be in effect until the end of December. And it allows plenty of time for you and everybody else to take a second look at whether the changes you've made in 2016 are really working and to make adjustments if they aren't. Now Uranus in Aries is in your third house of communication, siblings, neighbours, community, neighbourhood. Where have you made some sort of snafu in any of those areas? Where do you need or want or would like a second redo, a chance, a, a redo over? Maybe you had a silly situation with a sibling over something, you know, family oriented, jealousy, competition, you know, the usual sibling rivalry stuff. And maybe you'd like another shot at the title, or you'd like to talk to them about it a bit in more detail. Maybe you sort of glossed over it and you realize that things are still fragile, and you're going to be given that opportunity. Mercury moving into Virgo is its happiest place and while Virgo is not necessarily a sign that works well for you, Mercury in Virgo is very stable. The communication over the next month will be very black and white, yes and no. It'll be analytical and it'll all be about dotting the I's and crossing the T's but at least you'll know when you ask somebody something you should get the truth, you know, or 99% truth rather than when Mercury's in another sign and you get exaggerations or little white lies. So Mercury and Jupiter are going to be in Virgo for the next month and then at the end of August Mercury goes retrograde for the third time this year. So the next month it's really important that you, you know, whether you're filing your taxes, whether you're filing property taxes, whether you're, you know, signing up and divvying up things and things have to be signed and notif notarized, whatever, it's important you do it in the next month, really important. Have a great week, great speaking to you. Please subscribe to the Universal Psychic Guild channel for me. I'd appreciate that and I'll speak to you soon.